Okay, good evening, everyone. Uh, welcome to the online lecture for philosophy classes. Today we are on African philosophy, and uh, previously we've done uh, works on the on topics in African philosophy. So today we're talking about Sifa and uh, the divination system. Now, the Sifa system is the divination process that is done by a professional and uh, this professional has been uh, like a certified computer literate. This professional also has been given the authority to create and use uh, the set of rules uh, of the IFA system, using this to, you know, you know, dialogue with God or either the divinities uh, or ancestors, you know, in order for them to get information to solve uh, the human problem or societal problem. Now, uh, the system of IFA is practiced among the Yoruba community, and uh, not only in Nigeria alone, but uh, in diaspora. And uh, we should also note that the word IFA is uh, linked to a particular Yoruba deity, and this Yoruba deity is the uh, Yoruba deity of wisdom uh, called Orumila. So this is why people do go to uh, the far priest, you know, you know, to get solutions to their problem. The only person who can provide solutions to those problems is that, that one with wisdom. So that is why the Yoruba deity of wisdom, Orumila, is uh, the deity attached to the far divination system. Now, uh, we should also note that uh, unlike other uh, traditional, uh, you know, uh, oracle, uh, uh, traditional uh, spiritual consorts like uh, the wishes, like uh, Shongo and others, the Ifa divination system does not use oracular power. And I, when I say this, like if if you do watch African uh, movies, you know the uh, Babalawo or priest, we just call on something, those things are unseen, you know. They use tools that are unseen. Uh, they will just call the name of the person three times and the person will appear. But if I does not do this, if I use a uh, system of signs and tools in their mode of communication, and that is why when you see a picture of an Ifa priest, you will see the picture of the Okpon Ifa, of the Okpele and the uh, Odu Ifa that they use. So it is this system that they use to communicate with the unseen God and divinities, and when they get information, they are going to interpret this information to the clients, let's, let's call them clients. Now, uh, the IFA uh, literacy purpose, that is the uh, mode of communication. You know, in English, we have uh, re uh, reading and writing. You know, literacy has to do with uh, how to read and write. Now, what is used in communication, in understanding, and also in relaying information, the tool that is uh, used, uh, the literacy uh, aspect is called the Odu. Now, the Odu consists of 256 parts. 16 of these 256 are the major Odus, and they also have alternative. Now, each of these 256 Odus has its own specific divination system. Each of these uh, 256 Odu has its own specific divination system. Now, uh, for the sake of time and clarity, we won't be mentioning all the Odus, but we know we have some like uh, Igo Sumeji or, or Wong Imeji or Baramiji, uh, Ikami Meji, and so on. Now, there are, are much 
uh, in two hundred in uh, number in two hundred and fifty-six in numbers. Yes. Now we should. Uh, we also want to briefly talk about how the if Odifa is being read now. Traditionally, the Odifa signs are read from right to left. You know, in English writing, we read from left to right. But the Odifa signs are read from right to left. I will also note that, you see, uh, text like ABC and other, uh, and uh, the Arabic text are not the only uh, form of language, you know, we have signs and symbols. And so this uh, Odifa falls under signs and symbols and they are being read from right to left. Now, every Odu has four sets of two markings. Now, and uh, it's, it is also important for us to note that uh, an Odu has an identical symbol on the right and uh, on the left, signify that that Odu is one of the 16 major Odu. And what I mean is that when you see uh, one of these Odu, like, uh, uh, let me use an example, like Hikameji, it has uh, the, the, the sign on the right and then the one on the left are similar. This makes it one of the 16 major Odu. But when we look at uh, Osemeji, the sign on the right and that on the left are different. This simply means that it is not one of the major Odu. And uh, so the guests, the 240 are minor Odus, why we have a 16 major Odu. So that is how the Ifa, uh, Odu Ifa signs are being read. Now, uh, also, I would like to add on the aspect of the relationship, uh, comparative analysis between uh, the Odufa and the, the computer system. Now, I'll just be highlighting the some points. Now, it is believed that computer also got uh, uh, its origin from divination system, just like the Odufa. And also, both are means of communication. Both, both are means of communication uh, that has inputs and outputs. Uh, what I mean is that when the uh, Ifa priest throws the uh, Okpo Ifa, you know, it, it gets that is output, uh, output, you know, okay, sorry, that is input and it gets information which is output from that divination system, which he pass on to people, just like the computer system too. Now, it's, uh, it is also uh, what it to note that uh, both uses a um, binary system, both computer and the IFA divination system uses binary system. And you can see that this is evident in the 256 ODU sign, uh, sign language and uh, uh, what else? What else? What else can we add? Now, both of them are operated by experts. The a, 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 a computer experts for uh, the computer system and uh, the priest or the Ifa priest or Babalao for the Ifa divination system. So those are how they are similar. And even studies were carried out to see how the. Uh, if a divination system can actually be used as a computer system, and uh, this study was actually successful, uh, although uh, it has not been implemented because of our belief that uh, it is uh, more spiritual, but actually a study was carried out and uh, there were similarities between the CPU and everything and the EK and the point five and everything. So thank you so much for uh, listening to I hope this helps you uh, towards the, uh, uh, every activity you might need this for. Thank you so much. God bless you.